What's up guys? Uh, so today we'll be taking a look at Chimera against Super Heavy Samurai. So we will take a look at a, two matches. Uh, so let's begin. Right, so for this matchup it looks like Chimera will be going first. Uh, so let's check it out. Right, so they start off with Branded Fusion. Dumping Albaz and Gazelle, searching Kuwaita, Dona Luckboard, a chain called by the Great. Right, so Kuwaita adds Mirror Swordsman. Mirror Swordsman summons Performant, Performant gets you, Chimera Fusion, and another Gazelle. Right, so we use both of them to summon uh, the Fusion Chimera, bring back Mirror Swordsman with Gazelle's effect, add back Chimera Fusion, uh, set one, uh, go for. Chimera Illusion and then end turn. Okay. So they start off with Makaoshi. Alright, so a chain to revive Performant. Performant adds two cards again. Oh, one card this time. Alright, so summon Guardian Chimera, destroying two cards and drawing one card. And reviving Illusion. Alright, so that's a wrap. Um, so it doesn't look like uh, Super Heavy Samurai had any follow up uh, beyond. The on field monsters. Right, so Chimera takes a decisive game one. Right, so we're taking a look at game two. So Super Heavy Samurai will opt to go first. Right, so they open a decent hand. Right, so they start the Scarecrow, not searching, probably trying to play around draw. Right, so Ash on the effect, Akashi's effect. That prompts an ogre. Alright, so now they search at Soul Piercer, another Okaoshi, and then they end their turn. Alright, so Chimera started with Fusion Deployment, some Albaz, use Scarecrow, some Merge Ape, especially some Cartesia, and some Merciful, you know? some Performant. Add two cards. Alright, so draw the Lockbird, but in this case it won't matter. Alright, Fusion Summon Chimera, provide Merciful. Then return the fusion back to hand. So that's 15 plus 19, 24, plus 2 on is 45. Right, so that's GG. Oh, so it's 34, 21, and 3000. Right, so that is a very quick match, seems like. Uh, it seems like Kimra had everything they needed to combat the super heavy samurai. Alright, so let's take a look at one more game. Okay. Alright, so Chimera is going first again. Uh, doesn't look like Super Heavy has anything beyond Troll and Lockbird. Alright, so we summon Fusion Chimera, uh, revive Mirror Swordsman, add back the Fusion, Holly. Or illusion chimera and then turn. Okay, so they have to discard and in place. Right, so Wakashi plays, revive performance. So it looks like we'll be going for Guardian Chimera. Right, so Guardian Chimera, revive illusion, trigger gazelle to search. Okay, so destroy the two cards. Right, so negate with mirrors graveyard effect. And then we'll summon this new card. Okay. So this card came out in Duelist Nexus. It's called Magnum Uliva. So to summon it, you need one monster special summon from the extra deck and one monster in your hand. Um, and then it's got an ignition effect. You can target a polymerization or fusion spell card in your graveyard, place it at the bottom of the deck, and then draw one card. So it uh, recycles all your fusion. Uh, named spell cards and polymerization named spell cards uh, and then its other effect is when another card or effect is activated quick effect uh, you can banish one polymerization spell or fusion spell from your graveyard then target one card on the field and destroy it so it's some pretty nice disruption uh, for fusion decks and it's very very generic Right, so we're probably going to destroy the Pendulum. Right, destroy the Pendulum. 
go for Scarecrow, try to revive. Okay, so at this point, they don't have any decent plays. Um, so it looks like uh, Super Heavy Samurai didn't stand a chance. Um, yeah, they were beaten fairly easily uh, by Chimera. So beaten by the hand traps and beaten by Guardian Chimera. So that version of the deck is this one. All right, so it plays uh, three copies of Chair Elements Greed. Um, so this card wasn't played in Chair Elements, but it's pretty good in this deck. Uh, you can special summon one Chair Elements monster or visa Star Frost from your deck or graveyard. Um, deck or graveyard, uh, which is very good. So no matter the one where, no matter where the one card, the one Sharon is, uh, you can you can summon it back and then send it back to the graveyard to trigger its effect. And then Sharon obviously is a tournament, so uh, if it's sent to the graveyard by a card effect, um, you can fusion summon by returning the fusion materials to the deck, uh, including itself. Um, so it can actually summon quite a few of your fusion fusion monsters. Um, it can summon uh, this one, uh, Grand Gugnol. Uh, it can summon Lubellion. It can summon Dragostopilia. Unfortunately, it cannot summon Magnum. It can summon Rul Carlos because you play King of the Swamp. Um, it can also summon Graffa. So that's very, very good. And uh, this is the list that uh, I used against Super Heavy Samurai. Uh, it's, it's decent. And uh, it does have a few advantages over the, the other list. Uh, mainly having another way to uh, easily uh, fusion summon. Right, so if you enjoyed the duels, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.